here, this is the feather of a pheasant. And uh, let's say this is the tail, see? And after the hunters come home, we prepare it like so. And I deeply apologize for the animal lovers in this room. Anyway, and uh, those who are for the Animals Rights Association, please don't take this offensively. So, anyway, um, after we bring home the pheasants, like four or six of them, um, we take them out back behind the barn house. And that's, and that's where the, that's where the carving begins. Uh, and don't worry, it's not too bloody. And as you can see in these pictures, these are examples of what we do with them just passing on. And uh, so, like, like so, we take, we take the feathers off first, and they make good decorations for your wall. <laughs> and um, the wings, the wings are right here. We tear off, we tear off the wings, <laughs> and uh, we sort of unscrew the neck, like, like so. It's, it's, there's no blood, trust me. And uh, now, and uh, with for the legs, that's that you can't pull those off. You got to use a switchblade knife. And uh, then, sort of, sort of like this, you take your thumbs right here, right here on the chest, and pull the skin, tear it apart, and bring bring the meat out. The chest comes out first. So you have so you have the meat, but we got we got to take the rest off. So we got the legs. We sort of cut cut them off, and and the other one, and the wings. And uh, now this is the this is the hard part. You, you know we unscrewed the head already, and there's still something there, and we still got to take the chest off. So we we take both our thumbs, one for the back, and one for the front. See, and we sort and we sort of. Tear it right open, all the way down, and that, and there you can see his little heart, which is about the size of a quarter, and uh, his stomach, which is about the size of a, 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 a hacky sacks, and um, it, it, in the in those stomachs uh, there's corn. See, that's their favorite place to hide when go, when we're going out hunting. They eat corn, and um, and we don't shoot the female. No, no, we need those females to. <coughs> bring more meat into our stomachs, so. And uh, af afterwards, we, we, uh, we, oh, we take, the we take the remains of the pheasant, just throw it out back, and let time take care of the rest. And we throw the meat into the meat pot, and there you have a clean pheasant. And in, and in conclusion, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you have a, a wonderful Thanksgiving dinner pheasant and it's it's really good trust me if you if you try it I guarantee you'll love it and that is how you prepare a pheasant for cooking thank you